What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? I'm gonna show you the fastest way to get reputation in Adventure Quest World currently. The fastest way it's actually ever been in the game during reputation. Is this sort of a glitch? Maybe. Is it awesome? Yes, it is. Uh, so if you need the glacial rep for the new class, this will be the fastest way to get the new class. Let's get into the video. Welcome back. Happy holidays, guys. Hopefully you had a great Christmas. And uh, the new year will be upon us very soon. 2017's coming. Alright, so... You're gonna need a few pieces of gear to do this. Uh, some armor, of course. So, if you have the Cape of Awe, you're gonna want to equip that. Boom. So, if you don't know what the Cape of Awe is, it gives you 25% bonus to everything. So, this th doesn't just work for rep. This works for gold, XP, uh, all that stuff. So, it's the fastest way to level up, it's the fastest way to get gold, it's the fastest way to do everything, basically. Um, so, you can equip more than one. So, if you don't know, on the default uh, servers, on the live servers, like the not testing servers, the one I'm playing on right now, uh, it'll just take your highest bonus, which in the game currently, I think, is 25%. It's the highest you can possibly get for a bonus on an equipped item. Uh, so it'll just take your highest. So it doesn't matter if you have like three items on, it'll only add like your highest bonus, which would be 25% if you have the Cape of Fall, which a lot of people do. Very easy to get. But on the test servers, uh, that that doesn't exist. You can They all stack on top of each other and it just creates this insane amount of reputation or gold or XP you can get all at once. So yeah, that's it's pretty nutty. Um, so... I have a few items here. Um, there's a bad shop where you can get some just for having an account that's 15 months old, uh, which most people probably have. Uh, so you go here, go to badges, other badges. Actually, it's not other badges. It's in. Why do I keep clicking on that? It's achievement badges, and then you go way this way, 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 way over here. So 15 months right here, uh, the Doom Knight Battle Mage. So this stuff, the, there's basically a full set. You got the armor, the helmet. So this will give you rep boost. Uh, this will give you, it doesn't say what it gives you. It probably gives you a boost of some sort. You can read that on the wiki. Uh, the weapon gives you 15% rep. Same with these other ones. They give you 15% rep also. There's a cape here that gives you 15%. There's basically a whole set of armor here that gives you the boost. So if you have 15 months of playtime on the game, uh, there's a set right there that you can get real quickly. Uh, other, other than that, uh, the Armor of Awe set, the whole set, which would give you like an extra 100% bonus if the weapon gives you 25%. Uh, so, or an extra 75% bonus, which is which is huge. So if you have the whole Armor of Awe set, this is that's a huge advantage. And that's probably the best way to do it is with the Armor of Awe set of the helmet, the cape, and the armor. So, uh, once you have all these items and you have them equipped, I'm not going to equip them because it's not really a point, but because uh, it does work. Um, so, you're just going to want to change servers. Uh, go into a testing server. So, Safiri is currently a testing server. We're going to go in there. It'll swap clients. Uh, it'll have to refresh the page. And there you go. You just log in and then you go on the testing server. So once you're on there, you basically just farm your reputation. I'd recommend using a boost also, because then the boost will double the boost. So I can give you an example here. Um, on the live stream, when I was farming rep for Glacial, uh, for the new rank 10, uh, for the class is going to be coming out this Friday in two days. Uh, so if I go to my reputation, close that. See, I'm rank 10. I think it took me like an hour or something to get to rank 10. And that's off a quest that gives you 300 reputation per turn in. And I think, I, don't, I forget the exact number, but I think it was giving me around 13,000, not 13,000, 1,300 rep or something like that per turn in on a quest that gives me 300 rep originally. Something crazy like that. So basically, you just get the items, you go to the new area, or you go to the area with the rep for uh, the new class would be this area uh, for rep farming. Um, now someone ran the numbers and actually figured out that it's faster to do this one, uh, but you know it's whatever. You can do this one for 300, or you can do this one for 500. Now, if you're not done the quest, do not do the quest on the testing server. Do the quest on the live server, 
and then you have to wait for it to update on the testing server because they're running on two different like versions of the game so uh you have to run the quest on the mains on the live servers so like on a normal like arctic server twilly server and then you have to go on the testing server and uh then do the quests like quest lines will not save if you do them on the testing servers currently uh so uh, you take the quest you do it you turn it in and you get huge amounts of bonus reputation i can't really show that off in this video and you can do this for other uh classes too like say if you wanted the uh what's the class called um t t elemental inversionist this class takes like three hours to get without this uh little trick but with this you could probably get it done in like an hour maybe less because you are in like increasing the amount of rep insane to an insane amount you can do this with gold too if you had gold boost items to equip to your character and i don't think there's a gold cap on the testing server right now so you could go get millions and millions of gold on the testing server also if you're a little low in gold or if you just want to stockpile your gold up to an insane amount you can also do that if you're a little bored and uh, you want to see an insane amount of gold in your inventory all right so i thought i'd just show you guys that in case you're going to rank 10 the uh the rep for the new class that's coming out this Friday, we'll have a news video up tomorrow and a stream on Friday at 3.30 PST for the new event. The class will finally be out. I mean, it's already out, the test version of it, but the finalized version of the class with all the finalized stats and stuff will be out on Friday. And we'll definitely do that. And the last part of the saga will also be out on Friday. So that'll be that. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And uh, tell me your favorite part of 2016 so far. What was your favorite thing that happened? AQW or real life wise? I think mine. Uh, I don't. Mm, I, I, if I had to pick something for AQ, it'd probably be the Arch Pally coming out. My new favorite class. One of my new favorite classes. Um, real life wise, I don't know. 2016 was uh, Overwatch. Overwatch. Alright, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.